Hi everyone, it's JJ again. Now, if you've seen our previous tornado video, you would know that we made a bottle tornado that you could use over and over again using two bottles, one on top of the other. Now, what I'm gonna show you today is what I believe to be the best bottle to make a water tornado. So you may recognize this bottle at home. Maybe you've seen them out and about. These are pet water bottles. Now you can pick these up from any pet shop, not to mention they're super, super cheap. Now this, I believe, makes the very best bottle water tornado. And here is the reason why. So it has a perfectly symmetrical shape, plus the outlet spout is very, very small. These create the perfect conditions to simulate a water tornado. And we're gonna try it right here, right now. So I've got my bowl of water ready. I've got this water bottle topped up all the way to the top. As you turn the bottle upside down, you have to create a nice circular motion. Now, it's this circular motion that will start the process of making the tornado in the bottle. So we're gonna test this out right here, right now. So I'm gonna take my bottle and on the count of three, I'm gonna turn it upside down whilst giving it a circular motion and we're going to capture just exactly how it does. Right, one, two, three. Wow. Now the great thing about using this bottle to make the water tornado is that it doesn't empty super quick, which gives you more time to watch the tornado in action. Okay, so I'm going to give this one more try and I'm really gonna try and get a fantastic tornado started. So are you ready and are you with me? On the count of three, one, two, three. There's that circular motion. Wow, what a tornado effect. And it's taking its time coming down and out the bottle. Wow, fantastic. Let's see that again in slow motion. Wow, what a fantastic experiment. Now, if you'd like to check out our other tornado video on the channel, that will show you how to turn a couple of these water bottles into your very own water tornado toy that you can use over and over again. We also used some food dye in the water to make some really cool effects. Do check it out if you've got the time. Now, if you like this video, do give it a like and subscribe to the channel if you'd like to see more science experiments like this. We also have lots of science experiments already recorded and available for you to try at home. Do take care everyone, stay curious, and I will see you again very, very soon. Bye-bye for now.